Hey everyone, it's Candace Roberts. So I wanted to cover skin cancer and the importance of sunscreen since it is Skin Cancer Awareness Month. So we have Zio Skin Health, which is a medical grade line, um, and we carry a ton of different sunscreen options. So a lot of patients get very overwhelmed. They're like, oh, can you have five different options? I just need sunscreen. Um, I can't just go to Walmart or CVS and grab something off the shelf. Yes, you can, but most of the times, those products off the shelf, they just protect against UVA and UVB. So, we have four different rays of light, UVA, UVB, HEV, and IRA. So, you can see um, the outermost layer of skin to the deeper layer of skin, how those different rays penetrate. So, if you're getting something over the counter, um, just grab something quick off the shelf, like Copper Tone or CeraVe has some, not to throw any names out there, but a lot of times you're not getting the added benefit. So CEO Skin Health kind of takes it to the next level by combining different um, ingredients in it to protect against all four rays of light, but also adding different pearls for each product that makes them unique to that um, individual patient. So let's start. We have physical sunscreens and we have chemical sunscreens. Physical sunscreens are good for my um, super sensitive patients or melasma type patients or really sensitive acne patients. Um, that can't tolerate any extra chemicals. Um, chemical sunscreens are a good option for those other patients. So, sunscreen with primer is a physical sunscreen. It has a built-in primer in it, so it has a makeup. So this functions as your primer for your regular makeup, or it can take the place of a foundation as well. So you don't need that added um, makeup um, in there. So um, this leaves uh, a little velvety finish and it has some tint in it. So that will um, give you a nice, like blur the pores and give you a nice little glow. Um, but it is mattifying, so you don't have to worry about looking like a big grease bomb after. <laughs> um, so our next most popular sunscreen is Smart Tone. Oh, and this one has um, SPF 30 in it. Our next most popular sunscreen is Smart Tone. So that is a chemical sunscreen. This has SPF 50 in it. Um, so that'll protect you, again, against all four rays of light, like all of them. Um, but this one has little bronzing beads in it, so the more you rub it in, it'll give you this bronze glow. The kicker with this one is it inhibits future pigment formation. So if you're prone to the, getting those dark spots or that sun damage, this will help prevent some of that from occurring. Oh, I forgot, this one also has sperming peptides in it, the sunscreen with primer. Sorry, so many facts about all of them. Okay, next we have, if you're like, okay, I'm not into the tinnedness, I don't want a primer, I don't want anything like that in it. Candace, I just want something sheer. Okay, I have two sheer options. One's a chemical, one's a physical. So this one's a broad, protect, broad spectrum protect, protection, <laughs> um, but it is an SPF 50. This is a physical sunscreen. So this is more of the traditional type of sunscreen. Um, it won't necessarily leave you with that matty finish, matte finish, but it is very, very good for my sensitized skin. So the acne patients, or if you get an aggressive laser or aggressive chemical peels, this has nothing for your body to react to. So it'll be safe for those super irritated patients. Um, it's also good for body. So whenever you take that beach trip, this is great to reapply constantly to the body, to the face, everywhere. Um, it's great under your makeup too. It's just clear. It doesn't have any tint to it. Um, and then I have a daily sheer sunscreen. Sorry, we're sold out of that one right now, but that is a um, chemical sunscreen. Um, it, that is actually the only one that's water and sweat resistant. Um, so that's good and it leaves you with a mattifying finish. So that's good for my athlete, somebody that's like swimming or somebody that's playing a uh, golf or something like that. That's a great option. It's sheer. Um, that one's pretty popular with my guys as well. And then all of these sunscreens, they're great, but you need to reapply sunscreen every two hours, any kind of sunscreen, not just CEO. If you get something off the counter, random places, every two hours you need to reapply this. But do you want, whenever you have a full face of makeup, do you want to continuously reapply a liquid? I don't, I mean, that's way too much work. You gotta start all over again. So Zio just came out with, well, I said just, probably last year, um, a sunscreen with powder. So you pop the little cap off, you twist the bottom and then it dispenses some powder. So it comes off the top, the brush is removable so you can wash your brushes, um, I'm a stickler on this. So once a week you need to wash your brushes with antibacterial soap to kill all that bacteria. 
um, but you can crank it at the bottom to dispense the maximum or the minimum uh, minimum amount. It's a buildable coverage. So for patients that's very um, oily or just wants to kind of take the shine off their skin, this is a great option and a great thing to kind of throw in the purse and just reapply as you're at the ballpark or whatever to give you more protection every two hours. Um, so this one has an SPF of 40. Um, you don't have to worry about the skin reacting to this, if it's gonna clog the pores or anything like that. It's super safe for all skin types. Um, I have a light, a medium, and a deep um, color for them. Um, medium's usually my most popular, but I do have those deep patients and those light patients. So, like I said before, guys, you don't need to know which one works best for you. You just come here, present the problem, and we will present the solution. All right, guys, that's it for our sunscreens. Have a good day.